Well, you wouldn't be able to tell by looking at me, but uh, I am the owner of a home. I really appreciate that. And I am completely overwhelmed. I don't know what I'm doing at all. Like, I played house when I was a kid, but I was always the dog. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> when do those skills transfer? We used a realtor. They always try to upsell you, don't they? I was like, no, you don't want this house. You want that house. And I'm like, yes, but that house is $50,000 more. And with a straight face, he goes, yes, but it has very mature trees. <laughs> For $50,000? I'll take the immature trees, thank you very much. <laughs> I don't need a tree with a mutual fund, no. You, you give me the tree that blames everyone else for its problems. That's that trade for me. We bought a affordable home. They called it a fixer-upper. What they do not tell you is that when you are not handy, a fixer-upper is just a broken home. So, <laughs> we live in a broken home. Yeah. Previous owners had cats. And like, when I say they had cats, I mean they had cats. There was cat pee on the floor. There's cat scratches on the wall. There was a lump in the carpet. Turns out that was a cat. And <laughs> I take care of it. <laughs> but I keep thinking, like, who got the better deal? Houses across the street, they cost twice as much money. Huh? Think about that. I pay half the price. I get to look at these beautiful mansions all day. <laughs> They pay twice the price. They got to watch me shirtless watering the lawn. Just mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hi, Sheila. Your trees seem very mature. No, you can't trust the realtors. No, no. You know why? Because they can sell anything. Did you know, in certain states, you still have to legally disclose if your house is haunted? Think about that. That means right now, there are realtors selling haunted houses. <laughs> and you know they're just going for it too, putting all their realtor spins on it. They're like, you're gonna love this place. Look at the master bedroom, ensuite bathroom. Look at that clawfoot jacuzzi soaker tub. Trey Chic, don't need to tell you. <laughs> If you look in the mirror, you're gonna see the withered old woman and then ornate wainscoting all along this wall. <laughs> Sorry, what was that last part? Ornate, dear. It means intricate wainscoting. No, 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 right before that. Oh, you're talking about the, oh, the withered, okay. Well, um, it's an apparition. <laughs> her eyes at around midnight on a full moon, you'll notice some blood just kind of streaming down her face. It's a good steady stream, a nice strong flow. And technically she's a tenant, so that's some extra income for rent right there. Are you kidding me? In this economy. 